Pika Habachi Haba and this is Adasa. Hi. <laughs> um, today we are going to do a reveal. We're going to open Arts' new box. It is the Negev. And today we are, um, I've asked Hadassah if she would join me in this reveal because she loves the Negev. Right, Hadassah? Mm-hmm. So when we were planning our trip to Israel a few years ago, one of her requests was we had to go to the Negev. Um, and Hadassah, why did you really, really want to go to the Negev? Well, uh, because the Israelites, uh, well, Moses led the Israelites through the desert to camp at the base of the Red Sea. Yeah, so she just really wanted to see what the desert looked like. Today we are in um, our bus, and I'll show a picture of our bus right here for you because um, I am making a bus, this bus, this retro vintage bus, into a bakery for Hadassah to work in. So if you would like to see our bus conversion, I will link that in the description below. If you'd like to help us and donate to our GoFundMe cam campaign so we can actually uh, afford to do this for Hadassah, then I will also provide that link in the description below. Oh, I forgot, I have to tell you um, that Artsa has made a special uh, coupon for you because you're watching our channel. It's Teshuva25 to get 25% off of you um, ordering Artsa box from them. So when you go there, uh, put in Teshuva with an H25 and you'll get 25% off. They'll put that link here in the description below. So be sure and go and support our brother Judah in the land of Israel and um, sign up for your arts box. These are so fun to get in the mail. I look forward to it all the time. So here we go. All right, Hadassah. Oh, and by the way, this color almost matches our bus on the outside. <laughs> That's cool. Okay, let's see what they have in the box this time. Um, they have some postcards. Look at that, that looks like Shita, doesn't mm -hmm. it? Here's a hearty uh, yogurt sir soup. <laughs> sir <laughs> a hearty soup recipe. That looks really good. Park tuna, to picture of tuna. Ooh, a desert crossword. That you're gonna like. <laughs> cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you like those. <laughs> Little crossword. She likes to do those things. What's included in your Negev? desert box. So we have some spice. A, ooh, let's just open. I'm not going to read it, but this sounds fun. All right. And these are the artisans. So we're going to check these out as we go. Okay. As a direct result of the, of support with this quarter's Negev box, we were able to champion an eight additional, an additional eight small Israeli businesses and incredible charities. So how likely was that? All right. So pack your bags, bring a bottle of cold water and join us for this dusty desert journey. <laughs> As we continue our adventure down south, past Jerusalem, past the fort of Masada and the silent Dead Sea, over the magnificent, magnis, magnific, <laughs> magnificent <laughs> desert sands and into the mountains and craters of the Negev Desert. Yay, that love the Artsa team. Ooh, that looks Ooh. lovely. Look at all of them. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Yay. Unique hand painted ceramic dish from Israel South. I love the packaging. I think they really, really did a great job packaging. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, we can add that to the ceramic dishes we have. <laughs> that's, that's cool. Pretty. It's handmade. <laughs> I love it. That you could put olives in. Mm -hmm. for Shabbat or figs or dates or something when you set the Shabbat table. Hadassah mm -hmm. loves to set the Shabbat <laughs> table. So that's beautiful, thank you. Oh, I, this is so special, look at this. ADI residents who have Down syndrome, they make these dishes. Um, this stunning handmade and hand-painted ceramic plate was lovingly created by IED. Uh, the residents are children, adolescents, and adults with severe disabilities who created these plates as part of their rehabilitative um, vocational workshop sessions. The proceeds from each sale provide long-term opportunities for creative exploration, life skill development, and personal growth. That's really cool. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. How nice, that was made by 
uh, children that and, and adults that have have some special needs. That's really nice. Thank you. That's very special. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, don't you? <laughs> okay, I'm doing this one. I'm gonna do the spices. Ooh, Duca spice mints. I've never heard of that word before. The roasted ground peanuts. Oh my gosh, coriander seeds, sesame seeds, a cumin, and salt. Let's open it. I want to, to mm. smell this. Oh wow, that smells lovely. Oh wow. That smells really good. So then this is the recipe, I believe, right here. Hardy Duca yogurt soup that we're gonna use this for. So there's a recipe back here, good, because I don't, I wouldn't know how to use this. But those peanuts, that's a very unique smell. But I like it, it works. I'm excited to try that soup. We'll make a soup for Shabbat and try that. What do you say? Sure. Sounds good, okay, your turn. Uh, it's in Hebrew, I can't read it. <laughs> Ahadas but. is actually studying Hebrew. <laughs> so, let's see. <laughs> yeah, it's all Hebrew. Zuak. Zuak? Zuak. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bring a piece of Israel into your home. What is it? Let's see. Oh, it's a, it's an activity. Yeah, it's creating a together a piece of Israel. Oh, are there instructions? I believe so, right here. Mm. So I think this is a little activity to do. Directions for designing a Zuak Moroccan tile. So there's a tile. Yeah. And then here are designs right here. <laughs> That's cool. So in the end, we will have a tile that looks like that's a nice little activity. Oh, here's a little paint. I was like, where's the paints? But here, here they are, right here. I wanna try this one. Connecting hearts, the game that makes. Not every item that you get in the box has a card to go with it. I just have to check. I think that's fun. Fun to get things in the mail to unwrap. And I love that it comes from Israel and that we can kind of feel like I have some connection to the land that I so desperately want to go home to someday when Yah wants to plant us there, right? I bet you do too. So it's, a, it's an activity a game to be, um, to just uh, talk, talk about life, it looks like. My favorite Bible character and why? <laughs> <laughs> Who is your favorite Bible character and why? I know, um, I know, I know. <laughs> Esther. <laughs> and why? Because she uh, is you named after her. Because I'm named after her. <laughs> <laughs> Queen Esther, right? So that's cool. Something I received, I recently received and loved. An area of my faith I want to work on. A household rule I would set. Oh, that looks fun. There's lots of good things in there. That'll be fun little yeah, games. That's fun. Adassa likes to play games at ha on Havdala when we close out Shabbat. So this will be good. Okay, your turn, Hadassah. Mm -hmm. Green clay and lamb, mine near a facial mask. This is a mask, how fun. A deep certified organic and vegan. Cool, this comes from a lady named Esther. <laughs> <laughs> a lady named Esther. Uh, Esther's story is after traveling the world extensively, spending her time learning from traditional natural healing experts, she decided to follow her lifelong passion and study natural pharmaceuticals mm -hmm. in the US. Deep cleansing clay mask renews fatigued skin. That's mine, not yours, mine. <laughs> I need that. All ingredients used uh, are grown and sourced from her own organic farm. Ah! Located in the Negev Desert near the Gehar River where Abraham and Isaac dug their wells. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. Wait, I wanted to smell it. So all these ingredients are from her own <laughs> Oh my gosh, so cool. This is a, such a treat for me. I'm so excited. Such a treat for mommy. Oh, wow. That smells so good. I'm gonna just squeeze a little out here. Hmm. Wow. That smells so good. Oh. <laughs> 
I love that. that. That's, that's what I'm Esther, I love that. Oh, that's that is gonna smell so refreshing, so good. It's gonna make me feel so refreshed. I can't wait to. I'm gonna go do that after my work after work today. This I love. I love. I love. I love. A little uh, probably olive tree cross right here. Okay. <laughs> what is that, Hadassa? Super berry granola. This was made by Galit and Danny. Artisanal Israeli granola with a fresh dollop of breakfast yogurt and berries would be awesome. <laughs> Look at that. Healthy and nutritious. Flavorsome and rich in all the natural goodness that the wonderful land has to offer. We love granola. Very nice. Okay. That was fun, Hadassa. I like the Negev box, so definitely go and support Israel and our brother Judah um, by clicking on the link below um, and using the code Teshuva with an H25 and you'll get 25% off your order and go um, begin to get these boxes in the mail uh, every quarter and you are going to be blessed. It makes me feel like I'm in the land or like I'm connected. When we went to Israel uh, in 2017, one of the places we went in the Negev, uh, we went to the Dead Sea and, and that, we went to Shiuta um, Farm actually. It was a beautiful little bed and breakfast. Um, but one of the other things we did was we went uh, to the Negev Camel Ranch. The Negev Camel Ranch. Did you enjoy that? Mm -hmm. We had a camel ride, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we had an amazing dinner there. So I'll put a link up here to the Negev Camel Ranch uh, video. Yeah, that we did. So we did a little video while we were there. So we'll put that up here in the links for you to go check out. So anyway, thanks for watching. Have a wonderful um, evening and go get your, go sign up for your Arts of Box today. Shalom. Shalom.